Hi guys, I just wanted to quickly pop on here and let you know that I'm here for you if you need anything and I hope this video helps you. If anything, I hope this video helps you realize like how normal it is, the way that you're feeling and it's completely okay to be feeling whatever type of feeling you are feeling right now. Do not feel guilty if you're feeling a certain kind of way right now. We are literally in a pandemic so don't let anybody tell you that your feelings are invalid right now or that their feelings are better than your feelings we're all feel the way that we feel right now and i think that's really important to know and it's also really okay to feel like you're in a funk yeah, i feel you i was just feeling that way the other day and i wanted to take you guys along those feelings and show you how i coped with it and dealt with it good morning I made a poop mood today. I've been laying in bed for almost like half an hour now. My bed's made and I like got back in it and still laying down. I'm gonna get up, get shit done. <sighs> well, we'll talk a lot. Hi guys, it's Monday. Um, to be honest with you, I'm not in the best mood. I'm not in the best headspace. I have a huge like stress sit on my face that's going to start taking over my whole entire face, I'm pretty sure. But I just wanted to vlog. I watched a few YouTubers like vlog when they're not in a good mood and how they get over it and all that stuff. And especially right now, I think it's important to find ways to cope with things um with everything going on it's really important your mental health and like self-care self-love is really important to focus on that right now especially it's how i do <sighs> i'm gonna show you guys how i do that how i get into a better mood and show you mood boosters and all that and hopefully increase my mood a little bit because i woke up so shitty like can't even lie to you so we're gonna go downstairs, get some coffee, and make some breakfast. I made coffee, really happy about this, can't lie, and then I'm gonna go ahead and take care of the kitchen, clean that really quickly because it helps relax me and it takes like 10 minutes, so I'm gonna Give it a good wipe down, and that'll be a good way to start off the week. You guys, I quickly wanted to come on here and talk to you about some of my favorite YouTubers to watch when I'm in a funk. The first one is Taylor King. I really like watching her content. She lives with her boss, Alicia Marie. So seeing the behind the scenes of YouTube, what it's like working for a YouTuber is really interesting. And their roommate situation is really entertaining. So if you need a good laugh, highly recommend Taylor King. I always laugh or smile when I'm watching her video. So recommend her. Also next, Amy Roush. She is my go-to vlogger right now, especially when I want to be like productive or motivated. Love her days in my life and weeks in my life. And she's a really small YouTuber, so go check her out. Highly recommend her. And then this is the biggest YouTuber I'm talking about. It's Brooke Michio. Really like her as well. She's just really relatable. feel like I'm watching a friend when I'm watching her. So highly recommend her content if you need a good pick-me-up in your day. It's like 12 o'clock. I'm out on a walk because it's not raining and I'm taking advantage of it. Even though it's cloudy, I'm just in a long sleeve shirt, leggings, and I feel a little bit better. I'm not gonna lie to you. I washed my face, brushed my teeth. I watched like half an hour of YouTube videos of the people that I listed before this clip. So little things like that really help. Being the slightest bit of productive really helps. And we're just gonna go on for a short walk. And then after this, I'm gonna work out at home. And I feel like 10 times better, even though it's not sunny, which it was, but gotta do what you gotta do. And I think this really helps. The lighting in here is trash, but 
I just did a 20 minute workout in the garage because my roommate usually parks here, but he's at work. Way bigger than in my bedroom. I'm out of breath. 20 minutes of some of my like favorite workouts, and that me. Really It is 3.30 now after my face mask. I decided to take a pretty long shower and I like shaved every part of my body, which I haven't been doing that as much because I haven't been leaving the house. So that felt really good. It made me feel a lot better. So I recommend doing it if you haven't done it in a while and see how you feel because I feel so much better and clean. What? better than I was this morning, that's for sure. I'm like 90% there. I'm gonna go ahead and put on some moisturizer now, cause that face mask is pretty good and drying as well. I that with a little bit of Ultra Repair Cream by First Aid Beauty No Venture. And I'm also gonna put on some Carmex as well. I literally like feel so much better after that shower. I cannot stress that enough. Showers really do fix a lot of problems. I also folded all my laundry and I just watched some YouTube videos, kind of the day just to like chill, not worry about being too productive, but I also like didn't do nothing at all either at the same time. I also just changed into like clean, comfy clothes. And this is the Disneyland sweater that I wear all the time, even though I miss Disneyland right now, but it's safer to be home you're not stuck at home you're safe at home and i also just got these recently i felt like i needed more sweatpants because i really have leggings these are tie-dye sweatpants and i got them from shein i got them from shein if i can find them i'll link them down below but yeah i think i'm gonna watch some one tree hill now and just kind of hang out i feel good though i feel Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and stay safe. Bye guys.